When you step onto campus this summer, and over the next few years, it'll feel like something's happening around every corner. And that's not far from the truth. This massive multi-year project will affect every building on campus. The climate crisis calls for profound changes to how we do business and use resources. We're decarbonizing our entire campus by transitioning to a high efficiency heating and cooling system powered by renewable energy. Our new system uses state-of-the-art engineering, including low temperature hot water, simultaneous heating and cooling, ground source heat pumps, often referred to as geothermal, and large scale air source heat pumps. The new system will use significantly less energy to meet our heating and cooling needs. It's safer, more reliable, and requires less maintenance than our current steam system. Overheated mechanical rooms, vaults, and tunnels will be eliminated, along with all the wasted energy associated with them. The new system also reduces our consumption of fresh water. In a few months, Amherst will begin installation of 850 foot deep geothermal exchange bores turning the earth below campus into a thermal energy storage system. In warmer periods, heat will be removed from buildings and stored by the geo exchange system for use during colder times. Industrial scale heat pumps will efficiently boost the temperature of the stored heat and the new distribution system will convey that heat throughout campus with far less energy loss than our outdated steam system. Each summer until 2030, there will be phased construction zones, all of which will be connected back to the new central energy system. But after all the digging is completed and the landscape restored, you'd never guess that we've installed over 22,000 feet of large pipe under our beautiful campus, creating a hidden, sustainable infrastructure for our next century. Keep an eye on the Climate Action Plan website to stay informed.